Welcome to Classic Game Room, where I've got a controller that requires a delicate feminine touch, which is why I'm using it. It's the Fujiwork Pink Analog Rencia Pad for the PlayStation 2. Why settle for Fujiwork Blue when they also make a Fujiwork Pink? Let's all welcome the Pink Analog Rencia Pad for the PlayStation 2 which has a slightly different design than the blue analog rents you pad. Pay close attention and you may spot the differences like the little finger grippy ridges underneath. Pink. It's not just for the ladies anymore, it's also for dudes who like a lighter shade of red. And this controller delivers solid, predictable PlayStation 2 gameplay in a pink Fujiwork package. I previously reviewed the blue one, the analog rents you pad 2, I believe it's called and enjoyed the styling and build quality, the pink one feels a little bit cheaper, to be honest. It doesn't feel quite as well made, but I'm splitting hairs. They're actually very similar, and both of these controllers are nearly identical to the standard PlayStation 2 controller. So they get out of the way and let you enjoy the games. All right, using the pink Fujiwork PlayStation 2 controller. Games like Golden Axe and Akira Pinball on the PlayStation 2, as well as Ratchet and Clank. I test all these controllers on a variety of games. Games that use the D-pad, the front buttons, the analog thumbsticks, and the Fujiwork controllers perform as they should. They're not quite as nice as the actual PlayStation 2 controllers, but if you find them and you think they're interesting, maybe you'll save a few bucks, maybe you won't. I have a feeling you'll need to import them, which will eliminate any cost savings right there, but it is pink, and it's from Fujiwork. Where aftermarket controllers can often fall short is in button quality. Are they pressable? Do they stick? Or do they work like an actual PlayStation controller? The Fujiwork ones are pretty close to the real thing. I actually like them. I recommend them. And it's pink, so it may be the perfect controller for that little girl in your life who loves pink. And Akira Psycho Pinball. A big thanks and shout out to our friend Felicity from Worcestershire, England, who sent this to the show along with a giant box filled with PlayStation 2 controllers. It's the pink Fujiwork Analog Rencia Pad for the PlayStation 2 and PlayStation 1, and maybe the PlayStation 5 if we all complain enough about compatibility. <laughs> this lock on weapon is awesome. Love that. And I'd like to point out, just in case you're confused, I am not playing Ratchet and Clank on the Atari 5200 in front of the television. Although, man, that would be great if I was, because that means I could use a PlayStation 2 controller on the Atari 5200. You're all bitches! You tell them, Ratchet, you tell them they're being blown up with a Fuji work. Change camera.